Hello everyone. So, uh, me and Rory are going to play some Civ today. We're being we're gonna... very original. Yeah, very original. Well, the interface is a bit different. Mm. What the hell is that thing at the bottom? That's cool. Um, so we're playing the new expansion pack, which is Brave New Worlds. Is it Brave New Worlds or just Brave Worlds? Brave New World. Ah, okay. And... Ooh, elephants. Oh, yeah. And so yeah, we're just we're doing a standard size map. So there's eight people, apart from, including us two, and sixteen city states. Who are you playing as, Roy? Russia. Okay, and I'm playing as uh, Morocco. Except Russia is now in a jungle because Ooh. of no stockpiles. That's because I disabled the start bias, which is good yeah. because I would be in a desert then. Um, I think I want to get that first. So yeah, we haven't played Civ for a while now, have we? Nah. Not at all this year, in fact. What, this year? Yeah. We played this year, haven't we? Nah, it was like November last year when we started. Oh, right. Damn. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to be a little bit out of practice. <laughs> Quite a lot. Uh, next turn, please. No, next turn. Okay, yeah, um, we're playing on King difficulty, which is what we usually play on, I think. We think. We think. <laughs> so who knows, this might go really badly. Yeah. I like how they finally put the scores back up, I've been missing that. Oh, I can kick mm -hmm. you if you get too powerful. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Ooh. So... <laughs> This expand I, we haven't played this expansion pack yet. We've kind of both yeah. briefly brushed full th through the Civipedia, me more so than Rory. All I did was look at the World Congress. Yeah, so I looked at briefly at espionage and stuff, but I don't know how it works. I don't know how any of it works. So uh, this could be an interesting game. You said you were in the jungle, right? Yep. Okay, me too. Surrounded by citrus and bananas. Oh, I've got marble and elephants. Or ivory. <coughs> mm. So, oh, what's and this? Wait, deer? What do you mean? Deer have always been it. No, but it's just kind of weird because I'm surrounded by jungle and then I have just this one forest tile surrounded by jungle that has deer in it. <laughs> Is citrus um, just like a, a food bonus thing, or is it actually a luxury? I think it's a luxury, though it probably does give food as well. I don't know. It's a new yeah. one, that is, I think. I, th I think it came in the... Um, Gods and Kings. Yeah. Copper? I don't recognize copper. That came in it as well, I think. Did it? Did I just completely yeah. miss all these resources last time we played? No, I remember us talking about them last time. Oh, right. <laughs> so, after Gods and Kings, we got, like, Faith to manage and do. And that didn't go too bad, yeah. actually. Like, there's I think religion's a bit overpowered. Yeah, it did seem a little bit overpowered. But, uh, we got quite a lot to keep a track of now. Mm. We've got trade routes, we got to keep an eye on the culture and diplomacy and stuff, because it's all changed. I can't and now, actually... because we're playing on continents, then we have to think about actually having a navy. Yeah, which I like having, generally. But I don't even see the sea right now. I can't, I can't see how much uh, science I get, unless I mouse over it, because the, the recording ticker thing's in the way. I've just found Sweden. Really? Yeah. Ooh. Or, well, a Swedish warrior. Wait, barbarians are here. I'm pretty sure I turned them off. Yeah, you, I'm pretty sure you did, but... Mm, oh, well. Maybe they're just kind of just there. Yeah. <coughs> they just ruin a good game. Yeah. Nothing but a pain in the ass. Pretty much. Oh, man, look at all these elephants. And now I've found the Ethiopians. All oh, right. God, this worker has taken forever to make. Yep. I um, did say we could go in a faster speed. <laughs> Maybe we should have. 
Well, I don't know, research is going quite fast. Mm. Caravans establish lane based trade routes between two civilizations that yields gold. Can also deliver food and production. Ah, oh, starting to see. Do you know about that? Um, no. You can trade food or production within your own borders. Oh. That's kind of cool. That's weird. And the audio quality is dropped already. Really? Yeah. <sighs> see, it's fine for me on this end. Uh, well, that's the main thing then, if you're recording. Yeah. I can still make out what you're saying, anyway. That's good. It's because you live in, like, the countryside. Yep. Probably, like, the only well, we shall continue to blame it, anyway. <laughs> mm. I don't like how quickly um, I've discovered other factions, though. I haven't discovered anyone yet. Though, actually, I think I might have discovered a city-state border up there. Mm. Yeah, I have. Well, it does imply that I'm not going to have much expansion room. That's good. That's good for me. Because I'm not nearby to harass you anymore. Good. Well, that I know of, anyway. Ooh, citrus. Did your citrus tower happen to be right next to the coast? Pardon? The citrus tower you found, did it happen to be right next to the coast? Um, one of them is, but I can see like six different things of citrus. Oh, okay. Wow. You just. There's tons of citrus over there. Yep. Pantheon found it. Already? Jesus. Oh well, my they god. Must, they must it's... have some big uh, bonuses yet. Yeah. Do you see uh, yep, two, found... a citrus, a cotton, a banana, and another citrus right next to each other? In two places. Wow. What is with the resource distribution in this game? <laughs> yeah. Well, I found uh, the Swedish border, and they are really close to me. Oh, okay. Well, that's where my second city is going to go. It's about it's right eight there. tiles in between us. All right. Actually, I might put it there. Though I kind of want to... Put it on the coast. Oh no, it's definitely going there now. Just look at all those resources I can grab. Wow. <coughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven resources I can potentially grab from one city. That's pretty good. Mostly food resources, but, you know, apparently we can trade mm -hmm. these, so that's pretty cool. Wait, don't you need research to be able to clear jungles? Yeah, you need, um, I think, like, it's one of the mining ones, it's just after mining, I think, it's bronze or something like that. Hmm. Because that means there's actually nowhere I can put a farm at the moment. Wow, that's gonna that's gonna hurt. Yeah, it's bronze working, I think. Yeah, it's definitely bronze working. Yep, I can't actually do anything with my worker at the moment. So you've just built what are you researching right now? Uh calendar. Oh right, so you went the completely wrong way you needed to go really. Well, I've got uh, two things of citrus and some bananas in um, the territory I already have, which all give food and all require calendar. Yeah, but you can't. But, but that's to build something on it, I think. Yeah, but they all, they all will give me food. So, like, the bananas and citrus are both giving free food at yeah, the moment. Yeah, but so. your work, it, you can't build anything on it because there's a jungle in the way. Hmm. Do you need to clear the jungle? <laughs> yep. Pretty sure you do. Oh, bollocks. Yeah. I'm not 100% sure. I could be wrong, but I think you do. <clears throat> uh, how much to buy a tile? <laughs> <laughs> uh... They're like 65, depending on how 
What resources there's are there? There's 50 at the moment. Okay. Um, there's also not exactly very many places that aren't also just jungle, though. Mm. There is just and tons of resources everywhere on this map. Oh, d wow. So, I'm definitely going to get a city there. That's the song I need to do, because of those two things. And I need to get one there just to grab all these. I mean, I can't ignore that. I would like that one on the coast, but yeah, it's fine. What happens if you build a city on a resource, by the way? Do you actually know? Um, I do not. Okay. Well, I'm not going to risk it, then. I think like, you still get the bonuses of it, but you don't get the building bonus on it. Hmm. Could be wrong, Seems though. probable. Because I've never seen anyone else build a build like this. The AI builder uh, buildings or oh, city, sorry, on improvements, unless they've been forced to. Mm, well, you do see it sometimes when then there's like oil underneath the city or something. Oh right, yeah, but that, they didn't do that deliberately. Yeah. Unless you put them like hard difficulty, then they know where all the resources are. May work. Um. Yeah. I can't build the farm here either. Why not? I have no idea. It's a grassland hill, and do you have the research for it? Yeah, farming is the first one you have. You know, default agriculture. Build farm. I don't know. Then it is in your territory, yeah. right? Yeah. Maybe you can't build farms and hills. I thought you could, though. So you used to be able to. Maybe they've changed it. <laughs> Maybe. Mm. It would kind of make sense, because, you know, it's kind of hard to farm a hill. Yeah, except loads and loads of people do it. <laughs> yeah, but... I guess. But you don't put, like, crops on those hills. You put, like, sheep and stuff, don't you? No, you... Lots of people do crops on hills. Really? Yeah, how do you think all the mountainous, hilly regions survived? Oops, didn't mean to move that worker. You know, they found it on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I see. What is with these resources? There is just hundreds around me. Every tile I expose pretty much has a resource on it. Wow, this is going to be a nice run for me, I think. Hmm, well, I suspect this is not going to go well for me at all. I've already encountered lots of civilizations, and I'm doing very poorly, as you know. Yeah. Hmm, some good coffee. Ooh, let's go say hello to these people. Oh wow, they've got a pretty cool uh, area. Come on. It's quite a slow game, this one at the start, it seems. Hmm, they normally are. I guess. I do like the start the most, actually, of the game. I never finish a game by myself, I always just start again. I've never finished any game. Oh yeah, the only games I've finished are with you, and that's only because pretty much... No, we never actually finished them, we didn't kill all the AI. Oh, yeah, but we we get to a point where we just would destroy them all, it just take time. Mm. And we're just kind of lazy. <laughs> yeah. And so we start a new one. I'm going to start automating this uh, warrior soon. So I've got a really good area. I don't see anyone apart from a city-state. And there's just an abundance of resources. That's true. Yeah, I've got tons of expanding space.
I'm just gonna keep rubbing that in your face, you know. You mean like you normally do? Yeah, oh yeah, of course. I mean, that's not gonna change. Hmm. Right. I think I kind of want to go there. Yeah. Doing. Yeah, I definitely need that for these. Though this is jungle as well. <laughs> Let's sort that jungle stuff out first. Let's get that over and done with. It's only going to take 18 turns. Or a bit more. I really need bronze working. We're probably not. I, br I, I reckon I've got a whole continent to myself. It certainly Sorry. feels like it right now. So you've been enjoying the summer sales? Nah, not really. Oh, really? Yeah, nothing really I wanted. Uh, yeah, they kind of come at a point where just, there's no games I really wanted to buy, apart from the ones that have just come out. Mm. That haven't got sales on them, like Brave New Worlds, or Brave New World. Yeah, I found uh, where Ethiopia's city is as well now. I'm very much boxed in. So you're going to be going for a small empire then? Oh uh, look, a city-state as well, so even less room. <laughs> oh, have you seen the new uh, social policies? They're changed. Well, I, yeah, I've just got my first policy now, so I can have a look. Look at the... Uh, there's an ideology one you can get. What? Yeah, that's when you go into... Modern era. Uh, the modern era, yeah. That's cool. Aesthetics and exploration, they're pretty new. Okay, mm. I definitely want liberty, because I've got tons of room to expand. I have no room to expand. Oh, you can start, you can get piety already. Or piety. Yeah, you could always Yeah, piety. I thought. Right? No, you have to get into the next age, I think. I don't think you have... I don't remember. Mm. <clears throat> Maybe someone can tell us in the comments or something. It doesn't really matter anyway, but... Oh yeah, I forgot to move you. Go over here somewhere. Mm. Look at this empty room. Just all for me to expand. Oh. Why are you angry at me? Oh, the one city state. Because <laughs> you never stop rubbing it in. <laughs> <laughs> Not you, the city state. I don't care about you. Uh, right. <laughs> yeah, it's, it'll be their default thing or whatever. They're just angry at everybody. No, they're just angry people. Mm. I think I'll probably just go with tradition as normal. Tradition? Yeah. You should really go. F yeah, that's for small empires. Yeah. You should capital city be pretty strong, I guess. Mm. Well, I normally only get four or five cities by myself, as in that's what I aim for. So. Yeah, that's kind of what I do as well. Unless we're playing like Civ Four, and then you have to get lo loads more. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> normally on that one, I had. Oh, well, I filmed in every single available space. Pretty much. So I, I kind of like this one. It's. You know, you can still have these big sprawling empires, but have a lot less to micromanage almost. Yeah. Because when you got to an end game of Civ 4, it was just so much end of production, you're just choosing random stuff because you, you don't yeah. know what to do. And you had improvements on every tile in the game. Because they didn't cost money. Yeah. Come on, Settler. Are you building a Settler yet? Uh, I finished my first one. Already? Wow. Truffles? <laughs> Truffles didn't exist before. Hmm. Um, I don't remember them anyway. They might be from Gods and Kings as well, though. Yeah. But I don't recall them being there. What the I'm assuming they give food or something. They give food and gold. So 
It's got eight turns till I get my next city. Or at least the settler, anyway. Oh, I found another city state. I'm not alone. Mount Kilash? That's not. That's a new one, isn't it? It's a faith Sounds one. Sounds like him. Maybe it came in Golden Kings, because it's got a ton Probably. of faith. Yeah. I'm. I'm at the coast. Yeah. And in a circle around me are three different teams. <laughs> so I'm obviously going to be I'm gonna have to be quite warlike. Yeah. And quite early on. Yeah. You could also try and expand to other continents really early on, kind of do No, I didn't turn colonization into sort of thing. Discovered mining. Who's this then? Jerus a Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Blah. And stone. Okay. It's just me and two city states on this continent. It, I don't see anyone else. I haven't finished exploring it yet, but wow. Ooh. They seek a natural wonder. Oh, there's one right next to them. Oh, they're angry at me now as well. They were neutral before. <laughs> yeah, you're a diplomatic prowess. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's because my military units walked into the land, you know. Good job. Well... They have to be to discover them. It looks like they might potentially block off one area of the continent for me. Now that continent could end just below them, but it could also like lead to another big section. And that'd be yeah. cool if they block it off. I'm happy, nurse. Pun? Got unhappiness. Oh, I haven't. I've got nine happiness. Well, it's because I haven't managed to take any luxury resources yet. Oh, I've only just got an ivory, so I've only got one right now. But I've got tons in my view. You're gonna love this when you see my area. You, <laughs> my starting area. Oh, three turns. What the hell? Can you hear that? Yeah, kind of do. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. It's just something that keeps going up and down my street. A nice street cleaner? Maybe. I suppose that would probably only go up once, or I suppose one for each side of the road or something. Yeah. It's kind of a bit faster than that, I guess. Hmm. I'm just boiling alive in my room right now. How much gold are you making an hour? Or oh, turn, sorry. An hour? <laughs> yeah, an hour. <laughs> um, I am getting six. Wow, more than me. With no tile improvements. Uh, I'm getting five, <laughs> but plus four because I've got minus one for my tile improvements. Or oh, unit maintenance, sorry. <clears throat> I think it's just uh, roads that cost maintenance. Uh. Yeah. Oh, every like so many tiles, I think. Roads, for sure. I know roads definitely. Don't actually good. know about it. Other ones, apart from you know, ones inside the build, inside the cities. Yeah, I think that was a good Woo! move. I've got bronze working. Yeah. <laughs> Get some monument now. Right, time to go grab all these resources. Uh, a citrus luxury resources. Yes. Yep. Cotton luxury. And only counts Wait, if you get what? them once, right? Um, pyramids requires liberty. 
Yeah, they've kind of made the some of the ruin the uh, wonders dependent on which kind of things you go down. Social policies. That's weird. Yeah, it's pretty kind of good though. Because you know you could play a game where ev one person got pretty much all of them. Yeah, that's my job. That's what <laughs> I do. Exactly. It's for that purpose that I was born. Build <laughs> every wonder possible. See, now I can actually get some myself. Damn it. Limiting my wonder count. Because you know that's also what I'm going to do. Yeah. I'm just going to keep playing wonders because I've got very little room, so I need wonders. I think there's still quite a lot of them you can get, but you just want me to get all of them. Yeah. Well, it's not keeping me from going to be able to get Stonehenge, so that's the main thing. For Wait, now, what, anyway. What does Stonehenge give out? Oh wait, they changed Stonehenge, didn't they? Did they? Yeah, it gives faith now, I, th I think, instead. Used oh, to right, give, yeah, they did, yeah, I think. Used to give uh, eight culture, which I really liked. The culture and faith, they kind of go hand in hand, I think. Mm. But I'm not sure. I can't remember. So if I get C there, the next one kind of over here, and then I guess I'll probably... Look at all that fish, wow. I don't know where to put the third one, so many options, but some of them are really far away. I might put... I kind of want to grab that, that would be cool. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I don't I mean, have a massive road. Oh, well, actually... If I have in the coast, it can trade for the coast, that'd be good. That will save me some time. I'm gonna do that. Right. Okay, my second city. Rabbit. <laughs> Rabbat, sorry. <laughs> I might rename it to Rabbit though. Let's see. <laughs> my god. Wait, what? What? I can see iron? Already? Oh yeah, bronze working gives you iron. Does it? Mm. Oh. oh yeah, okay. <laughs> so I'm researching <laughs> it now. That's showing how well I'm remembering things now, then. Yeah. <laughs> um. Hmm. Can't actually do any improvements there. I guess I'll just kind of build a road. That uh, I've got a, a settler, and you know, it's I recommend you build the city here. It is a pretty decent spot, but it's also really close to Sweden. You don't want to piss them off? Not yet. Go for it. It kind of box them a bit in a bit as well, won't it? Mm. Do it. But then there's another spot that's open up that has um, some good resources in it. Well, how but... soon can you pump out a second settler? Oh, I've got a settler at the moment. Um, I haven't selected my next production, though. All right. See how long it takes you for the next settler if you want to risk it. Uh, 14 turns. Mmm, that's kind of long. <clears throat> well, you're cool, I guess. But I say piss them off. Yeah, but then they'll attack me and the AI gets worker, it gets soldiers for free, basically. Well, yeah, I guess, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I could skip some of the places there and go... Yeah, okay, I will build near them, but slightly further away. So oh, right. it sh shouldn't be close enough to piss them more. See, that's your... You're having issues deciding where to build it because of people. I'm having issues deciding where to build it because there's too many good spots. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going to take the next one down there. Cause that gives me what? Truffles, stone, two fish, and a, a natural wonder. <sighs> that is a great spot. It's kind of far away, but I, I, looks to, I look to be alone on this map, so. Apart from the two city states. Now, I'm gonna build away from them uh, because of the special resources that are in the different location that I may not be able to grab otherwise. Alright, oh, okay. Hmm. 
Oh, when you ready? Yeah, yeah. I don't think I even need a military here. Oh, they want... Oh, my capital wants citrus. Well, lucky for them, I've got two citrus spots coming soon. Oh, I have got the wheel. I can't build a road yet. <laughs> Damn it. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, that wasn't too loud. No, mm. oh, I'm right at the bottom. Well, the two out of three of the people um, above me are next to me. All oh, right, nice. Because I've got I've got China, I've got Sweden, I've got um, Ethiopia. So I haven't actually found where the Chinese city is, and they're the people at the top. Okay, but they're probably hiding behind one of the other sieves then. So maybe you can exert mm. pressure on both sides, who knows. Ooh, iron. What have I got? Oh, look at this iron. It's everywhere. One, two. Th oh, wow, the city. The city I'm going to place next has got one, two, three, four, five, and a natural wonder right next to it, pretty much. Uh, that's a good point. I, I, just I found two don't know if I'll actually be able to get any iron. Alright. Oh, no, you need to see this. I've got two city-states right next to each other. Blocking off the uh, top way. So I have this massive area just for me. Isn't that amazing? No. <laughs> I think it is a bit. Uh... I would like that very much. Right, let's get the wheel. Where's the wheel? Oh my god, ages away. I can see two things of iron. One is right next to Sweden, one is right next to a city state. As oh, in right, okay. one as in a neighboring tile. Mm. I really need to get some roads down. I'm not sure mm. if they're these warriors now. I guess I can send them exploring down here. But I'm gonna be in... I'm gonna get tons of iron. Well, as long as... If you remember, because I'm Russia, if I actually get a piece of iron, then I double its worth, so... Yeah. But otherwise, I can just try and push it into the... until iron is obsolete, which isn't exactly that long a wait. I guess, but it is quite... you know, it is around for a while. Yeah. But I mean, I can hold on with archers and that sort of thing. I guess, yeah. And horsemen. So you kind of need to play aggressive and defensive at the same time. Cause, yeah. Well, yeah, how can you play aggressive if you don't have iron? Especially at this early stage. Later on you could, but in, in right now, when you need to be aggressive, you won't be able to. Well, I don't need to be aggressive quite yet. I guess. But still. I just need to aggressively expand. Mm, I guess. I wish I could see your unhappiness. Uh, it's pretty bad. Yeah. We need, we need to get well, you in sometime. terms of t uh, in terms of space, the the bit of land I've actually managed to claim is pretty decent, though a bit too full of jungle, mm. which is making uh, things at the moment be quite rough because I just <coughs> can't work anything. So I I still don't actually have any luxury resources, and we're forty five turns in. Yeah, I've still only got the one there right now. It would have helped had I noticed that, that you can't clear a jungle immediately. <laughs> <laughs> right. I definitely want to get a cellar. I'm going to have to risk not getting Stonehenge. But, I mean, if it just gives you faith now, it doesn't really conform to your plan. It, it still gives uh, great engineer points. Oh, right. And really early, so... I really need to get roads. Fifteen turns to my next settler. Well, I've just found out that um, there was a, like a little sliver off to the left of me, and I found. That